for any of you that have ever had to finish lithium disilicate, you know that grinding on this material can be very difficult. So I'm very excited about a new series of diamond impregnated rubber instruments from Brasslers designed specifically for finishing either lithium disilicate or zirconia. As you can see, when we start looking at this, the green coarse grit takes off the sprues very, very quickly. What is also interesting to note is that I've been working with this particular wheel since last summer. It's now January. So they do last for a while. Uh, they remove the lithium disilicate quickly and cleanly without uh, creating a lot of excess heat. I use the coarse green wheel for my bulk reduction uh, in sizal cutback areas and removing sprues. Once I get that accomplished, I will go ahead and still thin out the incisal edge just a little bit and then I'll go to the pink medium grit to take off the hybrid layer, the mixture of investment and lithium disilicate that's on the surface as a result of pressing. I'll then uh, move on to uh, some of my favorite Brasslers diamonds. Here are the 863012 that I use for all of my surface morphology. I may use some of the thin diamond discs in between restorations to open up embrasures. Here you see me putting in surface morphology again with the 863 burr. Working on the emergence profile just a little bit. And then we'll go to the new little disc from Dialyte, again from Brassler. And uh, the coarse medium grit in the micro thin disc works very well for detailing your incisal edge and creating the lobe formations that you would see within a natural tooth. So we work with very thin incisal edges. I don't want to worry about those chipping. Here I'll come back on the lingual and jump back in with my eight, or 368 burr and an 012 size to finish out the lingual. You see the result of the initial finishing prior to layering. Here's just a couple of still photos showing our micro layering process and the results of the first bake after it's fired. You can see the opalescent quality of the new lithium disilicate materials. And we see our final bake here. We're going to full contour. We fire that. Now we have to very carefully blend this incisal third back into the gingival half that's already glazed. So again, I'm coming back in with my 863 to very specifically and carefully blend that and work out all of my aesthetic shapes and forms here, as well as my surface texture. <clears throat> Once we finish that, we're ready to stain and glaze. And we'll do a little bit of final adjusting with a gray-white uh, rubber wheel from Brassler uh, to help adjust contacts and to give us our uh, surface prior to diamond polishing. Hope you've enjoyed our video today. Our entire video series can be viewed at www.teamaesthetic.com.